What's up, everyone? So I just got access to the 2019 DFS Freedom Line prices. Um, sorry for the flash, and uh, we're missing some prices on some items here. Um, it was taken by some old people running a stand. I actually got it from one of my Discord members named Brian. Thank you, Brian, for getting this out to us. Um, there's like one page missing. I think it's the BOGO page, but uh, we know those BOGOs pretty much. But this, the main important thing is I want to go over the assortments and review some of the items they have in the Freedom line. Um, as I stated before, uh, it is in fact 100% a rewrap of most TNT items. So these are TNT items. Um, we'll go over some of the finales and which ones I think are uh, ones. W there's only one I really recommend. I kind of can't really recommend them all. Um, one of the prices on the Justice Found got kind of flashed over. But anyways, I'll go over the uh, uh, the assortments first. So my biggest, uh, I'm, I'm honestly surprised that the color party's under $300. Well, it's $300. I mean, the Big Bang, in my opinion, uh, with Founds, is worth about $200 to $250. So getting this color party, I have to see it in person, though. I'm hopefully be able to see it in person around on the 30th when I meet up with Redbeard at a DFS stand. So, um... I can't really recommend it because I, I haven't seen it yet other than this picture. Um, but uh, for $300, it's not a terrible idea. Um, and as as well as the gold medal, I'm actually impressed with the prices here. The, I'm mainly looking at the big dog and the thrill. I think these are really good uh, alternatives to, uh, especially the big dog. This is like probably better than the Phantom Awestruck. You're going to be paying just a couple more dollars. Uh, also, they have some like the Uncle Sammy assortment, sixteen dollars. This old DFS assortment. This is one of the cheapest assortments you can get. That's probably the biggest bang for your buck. Um, so all the assortments from DFS look like they're actually not a bad choice. Um, so I, I'm not gonna recommend anything other than maybe the Thrill of the Big Dog. I have to kind of see these bigger ones in person to kind of really judge them for for uh, you know uh, <laughs> for real. Anyway, so let's get to some of these finales here. So Justice is a TNT rewrap, literally the same art on it, if you look at it. Um, it's all right. I would honestly splurge and go to TNT and get an opening show because I, I, I'm assuming the price is going to be like $50. I'm not 100% sure because it says retail price is $174 and it looks like it's $54.99. That's what I'm assuming. Um, but... For the effects in this found it's it's okay i mean i wouldn't i'm not going to recommend it it does have a couple double crackle tubes and uh right here's the finale which isn't bad um but i would honestly spend the 20 extra dollars to get the opening show but that's just me i mean it's not a bad finale by any means it's it's better than most of phantoms finales so uh, this is actually decent especially the long crackle here at the end the one that i'm really excited about here is the psychedelic this used to this looks like it's a three tube uh it's kind of a reminiscence of uh the delirium it's actually pretty good, actually. From for thirty five dollars, it's uh, it's thirty five bucks, and you get a nice long three tube. Uh, they, these ones are really hard to find. Ones that fire three tubes at once for a majority of the duration. So, uh, actually, kind of uh, excited about this. This thirty five dollars is actually not a bad fountain. Another one is the uh, crazy colors. This one I found on the TNT website. Um, literally the the same logo. Uh, for something called Crazy Colors, it only shoots green. Um, I'm not really going to recommend this one. It's kind of meh. Uh, I would honestly just buy, if you're going to want, I would honestly just buy two of the Psychedelics if you want to buy it. Uh, if, if you have the money. I mean, the Psychedelic is probably the biggest bang for your buck. Whimsy is TNT Powers On. Uh, Bazaar. Now, this this is the old art. Uh, the, the current Bazaar, the one that has the red label, only has four tubes on it this one and it's pretty weak so if this is the old bazaar I'll probably buy it to see if it's the old or new bazaar because the old bazaar used to have like six or seven something crazy amount of tubes this one used to be like and some of the bigger assortments back in the day I couldn't find any on standout this actually looks like an electric rainbow um, rewrap that DFS used to have so um, anyways uh, some other items here jumbo purple rain we literally know what that is it's not a bad price uh, it's like $15 as well as Radiant. I picked some of those up in my TNT stand pickup. Um, I'm almost also 100% positive Taco Tuesday is a rewrap of Wild Turkey from TNT. And they have a seven uh, assorted founds. These, these are normally in assortments um, for $12 or so. You can pick some of those up if you need some items. Uh, but yeah, so this is also some of the uh, DFS items going away. Uh, Pacific Paradise and Shutterbug are pretty good for their price. 
Um, but yeah, so these are the prices for the Freedom Line. And as I stated before, um, I've actually seen some uh, Freedom Line DFS stands in the Elk Grove slash Sacramento area. So I'm unsure where that line is drawn in the sand of what's considered Northern California, what's considered California. Um, but yeah, so this is the prices. And I'm honestly impressed. Honestly, the biggest impressed. Uh, the biggest thing that impresses me is uh, the assortment prices. I can't really believe the prices. They're pretty cheap there. Uh, but yeah, I just really want to get this out. I'm sorry the quality isn't the best. You guys see a hand here in the flash, but uh, I really wanted to let you guys know because we only have two days till stands open, and I know you guys need to make your lists and stuff. So I figured having these prices are pretty important to you guys that like to make lists and buy single items, like I've been preaching forever. Anyway, so. Thanks for watching this video, guys. I will try to get some uh, my hands on some of these items for you come like the 28th, 29th, or 30th. Um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.